Hey y'all, what's up? I'm here on a YouTube video today. Now, today's video is going to be about a Virginia police officer suspended after turning in an undocumented immigrant over to ICE. Now, this happened back on September 21st, so about 10 days ago. Um, an officer responded to a traffic accident, um, made sure everybody was okay, got information. The suspect had no license, okay? He got his information, ran his name for warrants, a warrant popped up as he didn't appear for a deportation hearing, okay? Now, he had a warrant out, okay? Uh, so the driver, or the officer, cited him for not using a turn signal and for the accident, called ICE, ICE having to be in the area. He turned him over to them. Now, he was released three hours later with the ankle monitor, okay? But he had a warrant out, okay? Now, uh, the Department in Fairfax, Virginia, said that in 2007, they enacted a policy that prohibits officers detaining a person based on immigration status and civil violations. Okay. With that being said, he has a warrant out, okay, for... Staying here illegally for a deportation hearing, okay? So, he's already not supposed to be here, okay? He has a warrant out, okay? So, you know, I don't know how y'all policy works and stuff. But, you know, if I was a sheriff, I would cooperate fully with ICE. I've seen all these states, you know, not cooperate with ICE. I, you know, New York, New Jersey, uh, some sheriffs in Georgia, you know, um, a couple of Florida, of course, California, um, you know, that, that's stupid, okay? Um, you're letting these officers not do their job, okay? Like, you're pretty much telling them not to do their job on certain crimes. I mean, that's what you're saying, pretty much, okay? He responded to an accident call, okay? He found out the driver had no license. That's a crime itself, an arrestable offense, okay? He ran his information. He had a warrant out, okay, for a deportation hearing, okay? He cited him a ticket for the no turn signal in the wreck, okay? Called ICE, which would be the proper authorities, told them, okay? They take him. He gets released. Three hours later, an ankle monitor. Not because ICE doesn't want to do their job. It's because of all the people talking about, well, you know, they need to stay here to... No, okay, okay. There are plenty of people, plenty of immigrants that have come here legally, done the process, uh, you know, have jobs, pay taxes, don't have all these fake identifications, they have their real names out there, have real driver's license, have houses, own cars, all that the legal way. Okay. All these other people that are over here illegal, illegally and all this and bringing problems to our country, we don't need you. If you want to come here, come here legally and don't bring your problems with you. Uh, as simple as that, okay? It's no different than if we were to go over there, okay? We would need a passport, we would need all this, a visa, all this to stay. But the minute they come over here, it's okay. They don't have any of that and break the law. Uh, you know, just like the two in New Jersey, the two rapists that were let out. Uh, the one in Pittsburgh where the murderer was let out. You know, uh, I believe there was another one um, in North Carolina where rapists were put out. And this is what we want, more problems in the United States. Let these officers do their jobs, okay? If a police officer finds an undocumented immigrant, don't suspend them for doing their job. If ICE is doing their job, you know, don't let the government say, hey, oh, you can't do that, you gotta let them go. You know, that's, that's just stupid. Um, but let me know what you guys think in the comments below if y'all agree with me, if you're why, and thank y'all for watching.